Oh no, there's a bird. Find Vilm Shadow just beyond the reflection. Hey bird. I think you know what I am. Oh. That's you? You're crow? Oh. Needed that. Wow. Whoa. This is so cool. And the way it blinks. Oh, this is so rad. already kind of messed up. Oh, I'm nothing like you. Oh, jeez. The way the beak moves. I'm an ether, Likely one of many. Somebody made you, after all, and I'm what's left of him. Not that I'm the only one who can make that claim. I'm sure you've met many others like me. Whoop. course. That is by both necessity and design. Okay, that's fair. This construct you're in exists in many places at once. Any time you failed, any time you thought yourself dead, it would restart and shunt both your consciousness and hers into another world. Really? But you'll be awake soon. And then it won't be able to work like that anymore. Why? Oh. The entity is going to be claiming, right? Oh boy. Like, I feel like I have to be very- I feel like you have a very limited set of questions here. Like, don't waste time on this, you can see that. Don't waste questions on that. You're the long quiet, the god I made to rid the world of death. I am the long quiet, the god you made to rid the world of death. What does that mean? I was supposed to destroy death. You did tell me I was special. Yeah, like that. By slaying the princess. Once she's gone, everyone will get to exist exactly as they are. No more fear. No more howling chaos, just life. 
So you were- when I was stuck in an empty room of nothing, where I was just going to be happy in an abstract way, you were literal. That is your concept of actual heaven. Interesting. I'm glad you're letting me ponder my questions before I get to ask anything. Uh... If that's your belief, there's nothing I can say to move you. You haven't died. You cannot die. So you can't grasp the abject horror of dying. Yeah, but you always came back. That's the same question, but with more sass. Of course not. The only way this construct could function was if nobody knew what it was doing. But the bones of the universe are old. It's on the cusp of its dying breath, and the people out there are consumed with thoughts of oblivion. Interesting. Let me just reread that. Of course, the only way this construct could function, nobody knew what it was doing. The contract being the princess. So the universe is about to just break. It's out of warranty. And so that's why you want to stay this thing. I feel like you kind of buried the lead with that when one. When the patterns are wiped from the sand, when the board is reset, who will remember them? All I've done is give them a chance to live outside of the shadow of the end. Hmm. Let's ask. She is the shifting mound. The shifting the mound. The flow. The capacity to change. She is transformation, or most of it. Her nature is why I had to die, for she becomes that which others perceive her to be. But an echo can't perceive things, not in the way that people can. So, okay, yeah. So I was right in that she was a reflection of our narrative choices. She's just that put, like, but like, as a body in a world. Nature is why I had to die, for she becomes what which others perceive her to be. You have to die. Because you perceive her as dangerous, she becomes dangerous. So if you stop perceiving her that way, then she ceases to be that way. Or you are an echo of that, so that made her down to neutral. So I tucked a part of myself into the folds of this construct okay. to guide you. Got it. Okay. 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 Seems that every me you met did a real shit job of it, though. Ah, they were... You know, I'm not gonna comment. <laughs> <laughs> well, new set of uh, things here.
with some amount of difficulty. But you're an abstract concept yourself. It would have been preferable if you had destroyed her within the confines of the construct, but when I shaped the two of you, I made sure that you were strong enough to see things through. So killing her would freeze the universe in the way that people, well, in the way that things would still exist. I think there's a question up here that is worth asking. Yes, you will. But it will all be worth it. <sighs> Light. Burdenless. An eternal pattern of forgetfulness leading into the joys of rediscovery. Everyone will be with the ones they love. No more fear. No more howling chaos. Just life. Forever. I, I'm just... I don't know. This is... The thing is, I don't know if this is better than Oblivion or not. It's more that I feel like the people should get to decide for themselves if this is better for them or not, on an individual level. There's a cruel irony to it all. The only way I could share my dream with the world was to never be able to see it for myself. I think it's best. You can't go back from Oblivion, but there's a possibility that you can go back from Eternity. So this is probably the least bad option. Are you lying? I can't tell. But I've said my piece, and my time's up. It's like I said, I'm just an echo. And echoes always fade away. You know what you have to do. <laughs> 